Hi guys, today we're going to be working on these rainbow watercolor bubbles and the rainbow does complete on my thumb. This was inspired by a design on my Pinterest board that has been really popular since I added it and after Friday's ruling on marriage equality I thought that it would be a really perfect time to do a rainbow design. So if you'd like to see how I did this, just stay tuned. So starting out, I've already got a base coat applied and for my white base, I'm going to be using early white tips. You can maybe get away with one coat of this if you're super careful. I probably will do two just to level it out. Okay, moving on to the bubbles now that my base is completely dry. Um, I'm going to be using six colors and I'm starting with yellow just because it's the lightest. I'm going to be starting my rainbow on my pinky and then working around so red orange, orange yellow, yellow green, green blue, and blue purple on my thumb. So I've thinned out uh, a little bit of the yellow polish with some water and I'm just using the end of a couple different sizes of paintbrush to do my dots. I'm going to apply them to the nail and then I'm going to give them about maybe 30 seconds to dry a little bit and then with my dry brush I'm going to go and suck up the water and leave behind the bubble. So I'll be doing that for all the colors on both hands. And just to create even more of kind of a gradient to the rainbow, in between I'm going to overlap with some yellow and orange mixed together. Extra important when you're working with acrylic paint to finish with a top coat and as usual I'm using sesh feet. So here is the awesome finished look and just to give you guys a little bit of a look off camera here is the plastic lid I was mixing my colors on and the napkin I was blotting my brush on. Sometimes it's just easier not to always have those in frame, but they're pretty close at hand. Um, 
I definitely would love to hear what you guys think of this design. If there's anything you did special to celebrate love winning. And the reason I chose to kind of dedicate this to that is a couple weeks ago on Facebook, my mom posted for Love Day, which is the anniversary of the ruling legalizing interracial marriage. And I see a lot of parallels between that and gay marriage finally being legalized. Sometimes it really kind of blows my mind that within their lifetimes, it was illegal for my parents to be married. And even now, there are people who believe that it's wrong for blacks and whites to marry or believe that it's wrong for, you know, the races to mingle together. And I'm sure in 50 or 60 years from now, there will still be people who believe that gay marriage is wrong, but you don't get to impose your beliefs on other people. You're welcome to believe whatever you want, but you don't get to impose that on other people. So not trying to get preachy or political or any of that, and please keep it civil in the comments, but that's just my two cents. I hope you guys enjoyed, and as always, Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.